So the I formation, typically the way it's taught is you and your partner get on the same page before you hit the serve. And with the I formation, it's typically, it's typically a T serve because the return this away or that away, it gives your partner the ability to go get either one in a way that that wouldn't necessarily be the case uh, if you hit a wider serve. So it can actually kind of be a, a mistake often to go wide with uh, when you're playing the eye. Not always, but uh, can be. So conventional wisdom, you guys are on the same page about which way, like, like for example, you guys communicate, okay, you're gonna go to the left, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the right here. And that's how the eye is, is, is typically played, whether you stay back or if you come in. Now, the new way to play eye formation, and you see this, um, you see this on the Pro Tour. This is something uh, Craig O'Shaughnessy, if you guys are familiar with our stuff uh, with him, he's top analytics guy. But you both freelance. So what that means is there's no communication ahead of time other than we're going to play the eye formation. So let's say you're serving, you go T, and then this guy pops up, he stays there and he's gonna just read the return and based on which way it goes, he's gonna try and get it. So, you know, if it goes line, he's gonna go there. And if it goes cross court, he's gonna go there. And you're like, well, Will, what if he doesn't get it? Like, what if it's a good return? Well, you're back here playing safety. So just for a second, just like pretend you're almost playing singles and this guy's not even here. You're just waiting to see where the return goes and you're going to go try and get it, right? But now you also just have a partner who's trying to get it first. And if it gets by him, whatever, then you go get it. Now you would do it in the situation uh, you're serving and staying back. Obviously, you can't be serving and volleying for this to work. But you're just reading the return and whichever way it goes, you just go and uh, try and get it. And then when you get it in this situation, uh, your partner would slide over and then it would be a, it would be a one up one back ground stroke situation between, uh, you and the opposing player like that. But try the affirmation as the freelance, uh, play. This was actually like super effective.